What are these creepy animals? Why are they all so... Is that a pig? Okay, the pig is kind of... Nope, the pig is terrifying. The pig is terrifying. Run away. Hello, my dudes. Welcome back. Hope we are well. Animal Crossing New Horizons is a thing that has taken over the lives of pretty much everyone I know. So here's the thing. I don't want to say I hate Animal Crossing. Hate is a strong word. It's a little bit unfair. I think the reality of it is that I just don't get Animal Crossing. I've played past games. I haven't played them a lot because every time I try, I just like don't, I just don't, I just don't get, I just don't get it. What is all the hype about Animal Crossing? A game where I get to do chores? Wow, you're letting me do mundane daily tasks. How exciting! Guess how much I don't want to do that. Every time I ask one of my friends, why are you playing this game? Why do you want me to play it? They say, it's just so relaxing. And you know, I could use a little bit relaxing right now. Coronavirus is putting us all in this state of anxiety and stress and nobody knows what's going on. So sure, I could use something to help me relax. I'll give it a whirl. But if you say this is relaxing, it better goddamn deliver. Remove me from the dark abyss, Animal Crossing. Help a girl out. So let's play Animal Crossing New Horizons. Really hope I don't hate it. I just spent 60 bucks on a video game that I might never want to play again, so. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I'm ready. I got my Switch. It's time to play Animal Crossing. Okay, one thing I really hate about this game is the way that they talk, and they're freaking like Voices, like what in the world is that supposed to be? Good morning, we're so excited to have you here. Okay, like are they supposed to be cute? Because they're absolutely horrifying. This is nightmare fuel, okay? <laughs> I just got a text from my friend. I immediately just started playing this, by the way, and my friend texts me and goes, wait, did I just see you playing Animal Crossing? <laughs> I can't hide it anymore. Everyone's gonna know that I'm playing this game that I always shit on. <laughs> if I like this game, I'm gonna like seriously need to apologize to all of my friends who I've ever bashed for playing Animal Crossing. Can I have your name and birthday? Sure. My name is gonna be... If you know, you know. Oh, I can't change this. I I don't like the stress! I thought this was supposed to be a stress-free game. I already have stress. I can't change my name. I am a girl. I am ghostly pale. Yes, just like that. Like you haven't seen the sun in 30 years. Oh, this is the whole customization part. Okay, here we go. We're gonna spend about three hours just doing this thing right here. All right, who do I want to be? I'm so cute. Look at how cute I am. Okay. Oh, this is so very hard. See, I have bangs, but like, I don't really have them right now. They're, they're like down to here. Thanks, coronavirus. Can't get my freaking haircut. Girl about to learn how to trim her own bangs. Um, I want my hair to be white like a granny. Grandma Aggie at your service. Some of these are like, hello, I'm Billie Eilish. Those ones are straight up on crack. <laughs> oh, look how cute I am. Great, you're all set. Literally, you are terrifying. North America or elsewhere. That's rude. I don't get why these two are like talking at the same time. Like, it seems like a waste of space. I just wanna go, bitch. I don't care. Oh, I get to choose my island. Okay, well, all four of these look exactly the same, so which one is the best? Which one will be right for me? Well, this one, I could have like a moat situation. Uh, I want this one. Finally, we get to board the plane. Here we go. Okay, this is kind of exciting. It's like we're getting on a plane, going to my new house, on my new island. The one thing that like really made me kind of intrigued by this is the aesthetics. I mean, just look at this. Look at how beautifully aesthetic this is. But it's also super dumb. <laughs> like, what am I looking at? It's so cheesy. I know everyone's like, oh my god, they're so cute. I love it so much. But like, it's really not that cute. I don't know. I feel like I'm playing a game that's meant for babies. And that's just not my speed normally. I want blood and gore, people. Can you imagine if Animal Crossing had blood and gore? <laughs> like these cute, adorable little animal people walking around and just like slaughtering each other. <gasps> okay. I would like someone to make that game, please. I would play the shit out of it. 
We're here! A short orientation session. Ugh, everything about this is just like, I don't want to do that. I just want to run around my island by myself. Leave me the fuck alone. Oh, look at how they run. They like stick their arms out and they're like, Me! Is this a bear? What are these creepy animals? Why are they all so, is that a pig? Okay, the pig is kind of, nope, the pig is terrifying. The pig is terrifying, run away. You are all the spawns of Satan. What are you? What the fuck is even that? What am I supposed to do? Talk to this bear man? Fuchsia? Who the fuck is Fuchsia? Get off my island. Isn't this supposed to be my island? Why are there all these people here? Tom Nook. I've heard all about you, Tom Nook. I'd like each of you to choose a spot of your own. I thought I got the whole island to myself. Bah! Let's get started with a simple tent. I have to live in a fucking tent? I thought I got to build a house. This is some bullshit. Please collect your tent from Timmy or Tommy and then choose a spot to place it. So now I have to put my tent anywhere? There's too much decision making. I thought this was supposed to be relaxing. Oh, look, I have a waterfall, bitch. Okay. That's cool. Can I put my tent like right here? The music is nice. It's like, oh, this is pleasant. Look at all these penis trees. Don't they look like little penises? They got little testes on them. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? Oh, <gasps> I got peaches! Oh my God, bitch, I have peaches. Okay, okay. I've been seeing a lot of shit on the internet about this, about everyone wanting like peaches and getting shit fruits instead because every island gets your own fruit or something. This is just something I've seen a lot on Twitter and everyone's like, who has peaches? Who has peaches? I have motherfucking peaches, bitch. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. I'm the peach queen. Come to me for your peaches. Peaches and titties. <gasps> Look at this butterfly. It's so pretty. I want it. Can I jump? No, I can't jump. Jumping is like my favorite thing to do in games. Just hop, 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 hop into that pussy. <laughs> nice to meet you. Noink. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. <sighs> All right, Aggie, we're gonna put your tent right here. Yay. I'm too close to the water. What if I put it on the beach? What about right here on this weird little nook? Why is this so hard? What if we put it, okay, right, right here. Yes, that's it, baby. <gasps> oh, I'm so excited. I set up my tent, woohoo. I'm so cute. Okay. Yeah, look at my tent, look at my tent, and look at my peaches, my trees, a butt, my butt trees. I got my butt trees, I got my penis trees. This is Genitalia Island, thank you for coming. Hope you enjoy your stay. I'm not naming my island Genitalia Island. Okay, I already have a plan for what I'm gonna call it. Figure out where you're gonna put your tent. Make sure it's far away from me. I'll find you a spot. Can I just put them really far away from me? I wish I could live with the moat around me with no bridges, just draw bridges so I can be like, bitch, you can't come into my area. I just like, this is the one thing about this game where like, I'm all about the customization, building my own little island, but like, I don't want no bitches rolling up to my house every freaking day. I don't want to talk to you weird animals. Social distancing people, you're too close. Six feet, stop yoinking at me. Oinky, I'm gonna put you really far away, I'm sorry. I can't be dealing with you like this all the time. Alrighty then. Alrighty dighty. Where's that other bitch? What even are you? They are literally so nice that it makes me want to vomit. Okay, there's like too much talking. I want to get into the game. This is my problem. I'm just like always in a hurry when I play games. I'm like, I want to plow through the story. I want to plow through this game. I want to just get it done. And that's like not the kind of game that this is. This is like a, you just, you just do it. You just go with the flow. And I need to adjust to that because right now I'm like, let's go bitches. I get to gather firewood and perhaps a little snack. Oh, the way they talk is absolutely infuriating, but it's fine. I will get used to it probably. <laughs> okay, everyone's cleaning. Everyone's doing their chores. So happy I do not have to do that. I gotta get the supplies. Where do I go? Tom Nook, help me. Help me, Tom. Wait, there's a Tom and a Tommy. That's confusing, right? Why? They had so many names to choose from and two people have the same. 
You need ten tree branches? Needy bastard. I will investigate the peach-like items growing in the trees. Peach-like? Are they peaches or not, Tom Nook? What do you mean they're peach-like items? Are they actually butts? Butts are peach-like items. Can you imagine if I just had butts growing on trees? <laughs> I'm losing it. I'm losing it. <gasps> uh, you go investigate those peach-like items, Thomas. Guys, I think Tom has a butt fetish. He's a big old pervert. Aren't we all, Tom? Aren't we all? Tom is an ass man. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, we're back with the nice, lovely music. The music really, really works for me. Like, I didn't think I was gonna be into this vibe, but it's a vibe and I'm feeling it. I have a lot of weeds. That is the one thing I uh, am not excited about is that you have to pick all these weeds. I guess you don't have to. I guess I could just live in a forest of weeds. I can't believe he didn't even give me like a bag or a wheelbarrow to carry all these sticks around. Tom Nook, you're not taking care of your people. I literally can't get over how she runs. <laughs> She's just like, wee, I'm flying. Oh, butterfly, I love you. And we pick up a stick. And we pick up another stick. Okay, even though like I felt like this would be boring, I think it's the graphics. I think the graphics are making it not boring because this is pretty much what I did on the other games, if I recall correctly. Just like walking around, picking stuff up, picking weeds, talking to these weird ass fucking animals. But this time I have some beautiful peach trees, this lovely acoustic guitar playing in the background. I hear the waves crashing into my island. The sun is shining in this really beautiful golden hour kind of way. It's like golden hour all the time on my island. Why can't I walk through this water? It's not even deep. I can swim. What are you? A seashell. I found a seashell. I found another seashell. Okay, I'm really mad about admitting this, but I'm kind of having fun. Ugh! I have shit talked Animal Crossing to everyone I've ever met in my life. <laughs> Here we are, being a big old hypocrite, picking up sticks, running around, having a good ass time. All right, I am getting a little tired of picking up sticks though. Like, are we done here? I don't know how many I have. How do I see how many I have? 13, I have 13 sticks. Here come Tom, ooh, but there's another stick. I'm gonna just pick them all up because I wanna keep my place clean and tidy. We are gonna Marie Kondo this island. Does this twig bring me joy? Not really, so we gonna burn it. All right, where the flip flack paddywhack are you, Thomas? Oh, I can push this guy around. <laughs> I can pick weeds. I can pick the weeds. I like the little sound that they make. Pop, pop, pop. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Girl, you got big ass pockets. What is this, Hermione Granger's bag you got in there? Like, what is happening? You have 15 sticks and 35 weeds. Girl. Once again, I really thought picking weeds was gonna be my least favorite part, but the sound effect is so satisfying. And she just running with her cute little feet. Oh, God damn, Animal Crossing, you've got me. You've got me with your clutches of cuteness. I'm not sure if I'm really actually enjoying this game or if I have just truly 100% lost my mind. And this is the world we're living in now. I can't go outside, can't live a normal life, so instead I will live vicariously through this small, adorable cartoon character. I think that's what it is. I think that's the appeal. This is truly escapism in its finest form. Maybe not its finest form, but I do feel like I'm literally walking around outside getting that serotonin that I so desperately need. I can't stop picking weeds. I'm not even supposed to be doing this right now, but it's just like hypnotizing. By the way, he's not looking at peach-like items. He's still standing here like a fucking doofus. I'm sorry, sir. What are you bringing to the table here? You're not doing any help. Get the fuck off my island. Tom, can I pick up this rock? Oh, I can pick up a rock. What about this boulder? I would laugh if I could put that boulder in my pocket. It's bigger than your whole head, Aggie. Agatha. Going to the country, gonna eat a lot of peaches. Look at my peaches! Aha. I got a pocket, got a pocket full of peaches. Why are you taking my peaches though? What are you doing with them? Huh? I don't trust you, Tom Nook. Tom Nook, you a crook. Festivities. It's party time. 
Whoa, look at that fire. Oh, we all clap for Tom now. Tom is like the god of this island. It's kind of creepy. There's like flames behind him. Look at how terrifying that is. Also, like, stop bragging. Stop flexing, Tom Nook. I have participated in many ventures and endeavors over the years. What does that even mean? You're talking out of your ass. There is one thing I've learned about this game and it is that I don't trust Tom Nook. <gasps> it's time to name my island. H. A. L. L. O. W. E. E. N. T. O. <gasps> no! <laughs> I can't name my island Halloween Town. This is all I wanted. I named myself Aggie and everything. <laughs> No! Fuck this game. Fuck it. Fuck it off to fucking hell. But now my name's Aggie and nobody's gonna know why. <laughs> this is really affecting me. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? I should have looked this up. But look at all, the line is longer. Like the line is, is long enough to fit this word in it. Well, now what? Should I just call it Halloween? <laughs> Halloweeny? Wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I live in the town of Halloweeny. <laughs> oh, I'm so fucking furious! There's no abbreviation for Halloween. Samhain. Samhain town. I'm actually really upset about this. I was so excited to live in Halloween Town. Ah. What's like a good suffix for a town? Halloween. I can only fit one more letter is the problem. Hallo, what about Hallowtown? Hallow, Hallowtown? <laughs> this is a stretch. Screamland, where all your nightmares come true. <laughs> I really want this place to be spooky. What about spooky land? Wait, 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 wait. Spooky, spooky town? Can I spit, can I fit spooky town? Spooky, <gasps> spooky town! Spooky town USA, bitch! I'm still mad that it's not Halloween town. Spooky town will just have to work. I am Agatha of spooky town. <laughs> Oh, bitches, my name was so much cooler than yours. I hereby name you the resident representative of Spooky Town. <laughs> this is amazing. Aggie, could you please say a word or two as the new spokesperson for your neighbors? And my first option is howdy. <laughs> Without further ado, a toast to Spooky Town and the happiness of its residents. Okay guys, I think that's a wrap on this little session here. I named myself, I named my town, I got to collect some peaches. Signing off! All right, so I just played Animal Crossing for a, a good hour. I'm gonna be honest, I went into this thinking I was really not gonna enjoy myself. I thought I was gonna get bored really quickly. Granted, I didn't do that much. I like literally just started, but I'm gonna be honest, I kind of want to keep playing. <laughs> I don't know if it's that we're in this weird time right now where like I'm in quarantine, slowly losing my mind, losing touch with reality, not being able to go out into the real world. I haven't left my house in 20 days. <laughs> so I don't know if like the escapism of like feeling kind of like I'm going outside. I like, I don't know if I would love it as much if I wasn't stuck inside my house. I actually was having fun. It, I think the graphics honestly like really bring it up to the next level. Like it feels really immersive. Like everything is just so aesthetically beautiful and the music is so nice and the picking the weeds just like plop, plop, plop. And I'm gonna say, honestly, truthfully, everyone was right. It is actually kind of relaxing. I feel a little bit more zen. Um, My, my other camera just died and I 
don't feel like getting a new battery just for like two more sentences. But yeah, um, I actually kind of really enjoyed Animal Crossing. I think I'm gonna go play it some more. I would like to personally apologize to everyone I have ever shit talked Animal Crossing to. My microphone just fucking fell. I'm really sorry to all of you. <laughs> Granted, I still haven't played enough of it to like truly have an opinion. Like right now I'm like, yeah, that was pretty fun. Like I could, I could fuck around with that. Sure, let's keep going. But I'm like excited. I'm excited to build my house. I'm excited to hang out with my friends and go to their islands and they can come to my islands so and we can have a little party. I think I was having serious FOMO watching all of my friends hang out at each other's islands. And I was like, can I come? I've come out of this a changed woman. I'm gonna keep playing Animal Crossing. And to anyone out there who also hates or thinks they hate Animal Crossing or doesn't get Animal Crossing. As a fellow person who also felt that way one hour ago, maybe just like give it a chance. Maybe just like don't shit on everyone that's playing it. It is rather pleasant and I get it. I, I get it a hundred percent. I feel stress-free right now temporarily. I have talked for way too much. I am gonna go play some more Animal Crossing for the next a lot of hours. Lots of hours we're, are, we're gonna devote to this. If you wanna know if I still enjoy it after I play it more, probably not gonna make a whole video about it because this was a lot. But you can follow me on Twitter. I'm sure I'll be tweeting away about Animal Crossing or on Instagram. I don't know. I'm everywhere. Where am I gonna be? We don't know. But I guess that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel if you wanna see more videos of me being fucking weird. In all seriousness, I hope you guys are all doing well. I know the world is stressful right now. Do whatever you can to make yourself feel a little bit of relief, a little bit better. We're gonna get through it. This will pass. Everything's gonna be okay. I love you. Thanks for watching. Bye.